there, future astronomers and space explorers! Welcome back to your channel name, where we make learning about the universe as fun as a rocket ride. I'm Taddy, and today we have a super special treat for you. We're diving into the mysterious and amazing world of solar eclipses. So grab your telescopes, put on your imaginary space helmets, and get ready to embark on an out-of-this-world adventure. But before we jump in, if you haven't already, don't forget to smash that subscribe button and ring the notification bell so you never miss an intergalactic episode. All right, space cadets, let's start with the basics. What exactly is a solar eclipse? Why does the sun suddenly decide to play hide and seek with the moon? We've got all the mind-blowing answers coming your way. But wait, there's more. Stick around till the end because we've got a super fun DIY activity that will turn you into a solar eclipse expert in no time. So buckle up, space buddies. Our journey into the solar system is about to begin. Hit that like button if you're ready, and let's soar into the fascinating world of solar eclipses together. A solar eclipse happens when the moon moves between Earth and the sun. When this happens, the moon gradually blocks out the light from the sun. If the sun and moon line up perfectly in the sky, we call it a total solar eclipse. Four. Now, picture this celestial rendezvous as the moon orchestrates an interstellar ballet twirling into the cosmic spotlight. As it pirouettes between Earth and the sun, a shadowy dance unfolds, gradually dimming the sun's brilliant rays. Five, total solar eclipses happen when the moon completely covers the sun, and it can only take place when the moon is near perigee, the point of the moon's orbit closest to Earth. Six, now, Prepare to be starstruck, because during a total solar eclipse, the moon steals the spotlight, completely blanketing the sun in an awe-inspiring celestial blackout. This cosmic spectacle is so extraordinary that it can only unfold when our lunar companion is near Perige, the point in its orbit closest to Earth. Annular solar eclipses take place when the moon's disk is not big enough to cover the entire disk of the sun, and the sun's outer edges remain visible to form a ring of fire in the sky. But wait, the cosmic show doesn't end there. Enter the fascinating world of annular solar eclipses, where the moon's disk falls just short of covering the entire sun. In this captivating celestial dance, the outer edges of the sun persistently shimmer, creating a celestial masterpiece, a breathtaking ring of fire blazing across the sky. Partial solar eclipses occur when the moon only partially obscures the sun's disk and casts only its penumbra on Earth. If you've enjoyed our journey through the solar system, don't hesitate to hit that like button, subscribe, and ring the notification bell. Until next time, fellow stargazers, keep your eyes on the skies and your curiosity soaring. This is Taddy, signing off from our intergalactic adventure.